nothing was about money. It was all about a vibe. The whole country knew, right, dance music, this is where it's going to be. This is where it's going to stay for a long time. The music was uplifting. It's like, come on, let's celebrate our lives. It's party time. And people were feeling good about everything. You had the DJ's box right up in the gods and you were looking out over the crowd. For some strange reason, you connect with every person in the audience. They're there to go mad and you're there to give them what they want. Terminals in the gallery had a great atmosphere. But when they removed this glass that was literally like something out of an aquarium with the DJ's the exhibit, it went off. Bang. This whole acid house thing had happened while I was up in Hull. And I remember coming back down here and to my old stomping ground and everybody was dancing on that bar like it was New Year's Eve. Pouring out of the streets, dancing in the fountains, police cars coming along to stop it all, setting off their sirens, everyone dancing around the police cars going, that's it, that's it. My one more track would be Change Glower Love. CC Rogers, Someday. Probably Your Love by Frankie Knuckles. End of the night, not a screamer, more of a hugger. At least we queues around the block. Everyone was doing the mad dancing, it was packed. The sound is, was phenomenal. And she was like looking down at everyone, it was like fantastic. And the big iron bars for it, same industry, we just went off in it. We just drove off from Paris to Nottingham, you know, took the ferry and that was how good these clubs were. I'd seen it before with hip hop and new romantics and all this stuff and it was the same thing. It was something very small but very special and the people were really, really into it. They were great, great times, a great period and not just in my life, in everyone's life and we'll never ever see those times again. I'm getting it all misty eyes now. One more time.